Okay, final race here from Newbury at last. It's race 31 on your cards. It's a two mile one furlong. It's the Ghost Sapper Maiden. So number one is Armed Warhead for Paul Rhodes. Two is Deep Red Eyes for Moilet Surfer. Three, Kingdom of Colts, Joshua Sutherland, the favourite. Four, Call the Nurse, David Robertson. Five, Cumber Villara, D. Thompson. Six, Gilda, Kevin Meanhan. Seven, Overton Farm, Jim Murray. And I think VV Tamima for Doug Warren was eight. We're already started here. We're already into the first. We've got 13 to go. We're all over it. Nice little tight, compact field here. Maybe you want to take it along. Although deep red eyes for Moilet Surfer. Just noses in front and takes the second. Although a little slow. I'm not sure anybody really wants to take this on. Not a bad pace. There's still got a few to jump. I'm going to approach the next. And it's deep red eyes. Takes over the water. And all over that. Deep red eyes leads by a couple. Kingdom of Colts, the one nearest to us, the favourite. Vivi Tamima is on the fence in the red silks. Outside of that is Armed Warhead and Overton Farm. They're followed through by the Grey, called the Nurse. And then Cumber Villara and Gilda at the rear. But it's Deep Red Eyes, it's Deep Red Eyes has extended his lead here. He leads by five now to the chasing Armed Warhead, Overton Farm and Vivi Tamima. They take the fourth, takes it quite fast. Happy to Got himself quite settled now, so it's deep red eyes. They've got themselves a little bit disconnected for the eight. Packs of three, the leading one. Then we've got the three of Overton Farm, Arm Warhead and Vivi Tamima. Take this ditch. And they're followed by Gilda Cumber Villara. Called the Nurse and Kingdom of Colts. And they're well stretched out here over two miles. Deep red eyes giving them a bit of a merry dance. They go over that plain one, that's the six. Under half the fence is negotiated. And still well over a mile to travel. So it's still deep red eyes into the seventh. Oh, and he's gone, deep red eyes. Jockey took him up a little bit too early. And he slipped off, which has allowed Overton Farm to take the lead, but uh, reluctantly, VV Tamima comes alongside and takes the eighth first. And all through that, so it's VV Tamima now from Overton Farm. Kingdom of Colts, the favourite, just in between them. And there's Cumber Villara, the Grey, Call the Nurse, and inside of that is Gilda, and Armed Warhead. So up front, it's just Kingdom of Colts on his own now, and the Loose Horse Deep Red Eyes in front. Under seven furlongs to travel, Kingdom of Colts having a little pull there by his jockey. Now these horses really want to go, and obviously got a lot left in their tank for the sprint at the end. So inside the six now, Kingdom of Colts rises first at the ninth, a little bit slow. Vivi Tamima with a better jump. Cumber Villara didn't take it particularly well. The Grey Call the Nurse is there. Gilda looking good. Overton Farms dropped back a little bit. Arm um, Wildhead still got a lot to do from where he is. So we're inside the five furlongs now. And it's still Kingdom of Colts. Cumber Villara and Call the Nurse both pushing on. And BB Tamima, Gilda, Overton Farm. They take the tenth and a really good couple of jumps by Call the Nurse and Cumber Villara. Kingdom of Colts didn't take it well. So it's the Grey Call the Nurse that leads now. One under pressure is Cumber Villara, but Cumber Villara jumps it better. Call the Nurse was slow, so it's Cumber Villara here. Kingdom of Colts is back into it. It's two and a half furlongs left to run and a couple to jump. So it's Cumber Villara from Kingdom of Colts. Call the Nurse is third. Overton Farm, they're over the plain one. Everybody's over it. It's Cumber Villara still leads by half a length to Kingdom of Colts. Then there's Call the Nurse plug in on the one on the outside arm. Warhead is doing well as Overton Farm. They take the last. A much better jump by Kingdom of Colts to Cumber Villara. So it's these two now. A furlong on the flat to run. It's Kingdom of Colts. Cumber Villara. Neck and neck. Kingdom of Colts has just got a nose in front of the moment. Cumber Villara is fighting back. Cumber Villara, Kingdom of Colts, Kingdom of Colts, Cumber Villara, Cumber Villara, Kingdom of Colts. They won across together. Oh, a good couple of lengths on the chasing pack. Jump third was Overton Farm. So that's uh, Mr. Thompson and Mr. Sutherland. Since Cumber Villara has come up, but I think this could be a dead heat. Is it the first? Well, it's certainly my first dead heat. If it comes up as a dead heat, I'm giving it the kiss of stew. Let's see. And it is. No, it's not. Come the Valara takes it. By short head. Well done, Mr. Thompson. Second was Kingdom of Colts for Mr. Sutherland. Ah, blimey, guys. Didn't get to finish that at all.